Ever had a hair-raising encounter during a family trip? Picture a quaint family of four, brimming with excitement, journeying through winding back roads to their weekend camping retreat. Their joyous chatter is abruptly interrupted by the sight of a warning sign, Bear Country. A sudden flat tire throws an unexpected wrench into their plans. With no cell signal for roadside assistance, the father's only option is to venture out of the vehicle. With caution thrown to the wind, the father steps out into the unknown. Imagine walking into the woods and you come face to face with a bear. The father, spurred by necessity, ventures deeper into the forest, his eyes scanning the ground for a rock. The silence of the woods is almost deafening, each crunch of leaves underfoot sending chills down his spine. Suddenly he stops. There, standing on two legs, leaning against a tree, is a bear. But this bear isn't growling or showing signs of aggression. Instead, it's crying. Taken aback, the father cautiously approaches the bear, his voice trembling slightly as he says, Hey, Mr. Bear, what's wrong with you? Why are you crying? The bear seemingly unthreatened responds his voice echoing through the silent woods i just feel so bad for you the father puzzled asks why i don't understand and then the bear reveals why he feels sorry for the father you see the bear was sorry for the father not because he was in danger but because he had disregarded the warning sign why do you think i can't read the father asked bemused the bear, with a somber tone in his deep, rumbling voice, replied, Because you're here in the woods with me, despite the clear warning. A shiver ran down the father's spine as he realized his mistake. The bear's words echoed in the silence. Because you were warned, and now you are mine. So, what can we take away from this chilling encounter? This tale underscores the vital importance of heeding warning signs, particularly in unknown territories. It's a stark reminder that ignorance can be fatal. Remember, in the wilderness, it's not just about survival, it's about respect and understanding the rules of nature.